Hi, I'm just going to show you how the quickest way to install a Joomla photo template. It's really simple, really easy to do. When you get the buy template, you'll have this download file that says click to open Joomla photo template. We click on it. We drag the file onto our desktop. Okay, how easy is that? For this video, I'm using GoDaddy web hosting, so I'm going to upload my the Joomla photo template to my web server on GoDaddy. So every hosting has this feature, it's really simple to upload your files, really easy. You look for the thing that says File Manager. Now File Manager, it manages files, it helps you to upload files, delete files and download files. That's why it's a File Manager, so that's where you manage your files. Now if you can't find this feature on your web hosting, there's this, I'm sure your hosting will have this feature, every hosting does, it's called the help button. Just open a support ticket, say how do I upload files to my server, and they'll tell you how to do it. Okay, so now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to click on the file manager button. So I'm in my GoDaddy host now, so we just click on the Browse button and you need to go to your uh, Click to Open folder that we put on our desktop and we'll go to the most popular recommended setup, which is this folder here. We're going to click on this file and we're going to click on Open. Okay, so when our file is uploaded, we should see all the Joomla installation files here. Okay, now we come to the best part, which is installing your website. It's really easy. So first thing, you just put your site name, that's obvious, it's your website's name. Description, well, whatever your website's about, or your photography. Uh, then you put your admin email address, or your email address, your admin username, and you can put a password here and you can put my password again here just to confirm click next that's it really easy okay so the next thing you need to do you need to also set up a mysql database if you don't know how to do that just ask your hosting company how do i set up a mysql database and they'll send you the info okay so once you've got that set up you just go click on the home button there get the info i need you're going to put your, where it says host, it, host name, you put this number here. So just copy that number and you paste it in here. And for your username, where you see it says user here. So it's really simple stuff, really easy. Just copy that and just put that in there. Your passwords, wherever you used for, to access this, put in there. And you just put your thing you use for your username again in here. So both is that the same. Then you just click on the button and say next. That's it. Okay, so then we just click on the install button again. And we just click on this button here, remove installation folder. See site. There you go, everything's installed. To log into your website, all you have to do is just put the word administrator after your website's name there. And we just press on the enter key. And now you put your username here that we did earlier and your password. And now we can log in and make the changes to our website, which I'll show you to do in the next videos. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it most helpful. 